As of this year, 2024, many people around the world are semi-awake. They know we do not live in a true reality. We live in a simulation, a matrix, a prison planet. Numerous questions arise from this premise, but one of the most important is, what is it that makes the matrix control humanity? In a sense, money is responsible for that. Whoever created money did not create a mere exchange item, but a tool that makes people become slaves, directly or indirectly. Our living depends on how much money we have and how we deal with it. This is a reality that no one can deny. The first thing to recognize is that money controls us. Everything we do involves money. We work nine to five to earn money. We go on vacations if we have money to spend on tickets, hotels, and so on. We retire at a specific age, depending on how much money we possess or have in our retirement accounts. We buy a house, depending on how much money we earn. We feed ourselves according to how much money we earn and the value we place on our nutrition. We become poor because of a lack of money. We become rich because of the enormous amount of money we have. Everything, absolutely everything, is based on money. This is because we live in a world where money governs our lives, whether we want it to or not. Does this mean money is good or bad? Not at all. It all depends on how we use it. Does this mean we are slaves to money? In a way, yes, we are. Can we do something about it? Yes, we can. But do we know what and how? This is the million dollar question to answer. The first step to changing our lives for the better is to recognize this fact. Money governs us one way or another, and we cannot escape it. Once we accept this truth, we need to think of ways to live a better life, even while money governs us. This is where people get stuck because no one teaches us how. Every single parent, teacher, professor, influencer, investor, and so on, all teach us how to make more money, the substance of our slavery, as long as we continue focusing on making more money and working towards that goal, we will remain trapped in this 3D reality. Thus, we will not advance to the next dimension, 5D, 